February 27, 2024 will go down as the day Pokemon disappointed its fans with the worst Pokemon Direct ever. Victor. What's that sound? Pokemon Legends up! This Direct had a whole lot of nothing in it. They announced Pokemon Card and FT Collector. Apparently Pokemon Cafe is still a thing. And Pokemon Masters EX has still not died. I'm going to kill that game if I have to. But the most important information was at the very end when Mr. Pokemon gave us this. Please let me have your children. Pokemon Legend Za or Z or Zaza has officially been confirmed and it's slated to come out in 2025. Huh? That's the big news. That's the big reveal. Game Freak is finally putting more time into the development of their games. I think my heart just skipped a beat. Pokemon Legends Arceus is one of the greatest Pokemon games to ever release. But let's be honest here, the game looks like a PlayStation 2 game. He stole that joke from Donkey! You son of a bitch! As much as Legends Arceus had so much going for it, the game had many flaws and was riddled with issues that a few months of development could have fixed or been avoided. But sadly, because of Game Freak's strict release schedule, Legends Arceus and Scarlet and Violet were both half-baked games that could have easily been so much better. Back in the good old days, when Game Freak had more than four workers and was working on simpler 2D games, Releasing a new game every year made sense, but since 2018, we've entered into this home console era, so it's a lot more difficult to create a high quality game on a home console every single year! So now that Game Freak is officially taking an extra year of development, it means that Pokemon Legends Saw is considered a time skip game. What the f did I write? A time skip game is a Pokemon game that takes an extra year of development because Game Freak is gonna make us enter into a new era. Games like Pokemon Platinum, Gold and Silver, and Sun and Moon are considered time skip games because Game Freak is taking an extra year to develop them and they're beloved by everyone who plays them. Okay, maybe not Sun and Moon, but it's beautiful to me! So when Pokemon takes an extra year to develop their games, it might be leading to a new era of Pokemon because the Switch 2 is right around the corner to be announced. Or Game Freak is finally listening to us and wants to create better games instead of giving a slop like they've been doing in the last few years. And the cherry on top is we're getting another Legends game. The truth is I didn't think we were gonna get another Legends game so soon because Legends Arceus didn't sell as well as the other mainline games because it was a single title and most people thought it was a spin-off game that wasn't part of the mainline series. Pokemon Legends Arceus is a complete deviation from every single Pokemon game ever released so seeing one so soon is really amazing. So now that Pokemon is working on another Legends games this means that Legends is officially becoming a series and we will be getting more Legends games down the line. So what it seems like is the Legends franchise is going to be a different way to experience the Pokemon world without being a Pokemon trainer. But it also seems like we're not going to get the same exact game we got when we played Legends Arceus. Legends Arceus is an altered timeline of the Pokemon world where the Industrial Revolution never happened so the people of Pokemon could not mass produce Pokeballs and could not easily capture Pokemon. So more wild and ferocious Pokemon live all over the world. And now in Pokemon Legends Z8 we might be getting a new type of game style where we build a city rather than explore a new territory that's never been explored before. I, I think? I have no idea what this game is gonna be. So basically the Legends franchise is gonna be a different way of viewing the Pokemon world, which is really cool. But that was also the job of the spin-off games. Which kind of also implies that we're never gonna get another spin-off game. And if everything I said about the Direct is remotely true, that means Game Freak is taking its time with the games, they're finally listening to us, and we're gonna be getting more Legends games down the line. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you could like and subscribe, I'd greatly appreciate it. I'm really excited about the Pokemon franchise, and honestly, I can't wait until Game Freak surprises us with something amazing. Also, genuine question, how the f do you pronounce this game? I keep calling it Pokemon Legends Zah!